Welcome to the Writing Room with Janet B. Fuller. I look forward to our writing journey together. In the first video, which you can find in the description box below, I introduced myself. Check it out. Today we are going to answer the question, what is the best age to start a career in writing? By the end of this video, you should make up your mind one way or the other. So let's get right into it. Are you a teenager? Do you think that you're too young to write your first book? If your answer is yes, you are wrong. There are a number of successful writers who published their first novels in their teens. See the link in the description box below to find out who they are. Recently, I had a conversation with a 30-something year old lady. She said that she wrote a book when she was 16 and she's just now ready to share it with an audience. Be like that lady. Write your stories. Eventually, you will develop the confidence to share them with an audience. I'm challenging you teenagers who are watching this video to start your writing journey today. Are you between the ages of 20 and 40? Apparently, this is a good time to start your career in writing. It is during this period that many writers start their careers. If you are in this group, I don't think that you are worried about being too young to write. Your concern probably is about what to write. If you stick with me, we can remedy that. Is it too late for people in their 40s? 50s, 60s, 70s and older to write and to possibly have a lucrative career writing? The answer is definitely not. See the link in the description box below where you may discover that some of your favorite authors started their writing careers after the age of 40 or they had started their writing career earlier but found financial success and acclaim writing after the age of 40. So if you are over 40 and you are wrestling with the question about whether or not to write that memoir that you think you should write or that children's story that's been crying out for release or your first novel in any genre that you like or a non-fiction book on any subject in which you are interested, you have permission to start writing. And if you are a parent and your preteens declare that they are writing a book, encourage them. They are practicing for the real deal. You may be just starting out on your career path, or you may be switching career paths. Or, writing is that hobby that you always wanted to start. I believe that everyone has a book in them that is waiting to be written. It doesn't matter your age you have experiences experiences are the prompts from which writers begin their writing journey you could all write any story from the following prompts and they would all be different stories and equally entertaining So what is the best age to start writing? The answer to this question is simple. If you are watching this video, you are ready to write your story. But there are a few things to keep in mind. First, if you want to be published by a traditional publisher, being young seems to be an advantage. I read somewhere that traditional publishers prefer to get more than one book from a writer they sign. Apparently, they believe that the older writer may lack the writing longevity that they require to boost their return on investment. This doesn't mean that an older writer will not be published by traditional publishers. The evidence is there for all to see. If editors deem that your work is excellent and it ticks all their boxes, whatever those boxes are, you may be in for a ride 
towards fame, fortune, and recognition, whatever drives you. Second, remember that we live in a world where writers no longer need to depend on traditional publishers for their books to see the light of day. There are many indie publishing options out there, and there are a number of writers who have received mainstream success after they independently published their books. So if you want to write, write. There is no right age to start writing, and you determine the right time to begin your writing journey. My right time to write was in my 40s. Since I made the decision to write, I have written many articles, short stories, two non-fiction books, and enough poems for a book of poetry. As long as you have a passion for writing and you believe that you have something to say that somebody somewhere has an interest in, go for it. Your writing success will depend on how you choose to define success for yourself. Probably seeing your book in print will be success enough for you. Probably making enough money from your writing to live comfortably, comfortably as defined by you, will be success enough. Or probably writing for the sake of writing will be success enough. Achieving a place on a bestsellers list is the ultimate success. It is a dream of many writers. Use that as your motivation to write your stories. Finally, I don't have to tell you that success as defined by society or by you is not guaranteed. But if you have the writing bug, write anyway. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. See you in the next video when I'll begin to explore the writing process with you and to show you how to manage it.